Hi guys, Mike here, U.S. Launch Report. Uh, you're looking at uh, Falcon 9 Starlink Launch Pad 40, SpaceX Starlink. They're prepping for the static fire test that's supposed to be going this evening. Uh, it's sunset right now, it's about 7.30. So this is probably the last daylight view we'll have of it. Just wanted to give you a shot of our monitor. That's a shot of our monitor. And we'll be bringing you a static fire video. If we can manage to get it. You know, they'll probably do the static fire sometime later tonight. My guess is that they'll do it right around 10.30 when the rocket's going to launch, normally. That's just a guess, though. Nobody has any way of knowing. Uh, but it is pretty cool that they have the, the payload up there. You know, it's, uh, it's really nice that they have the payload. And, uh, you know, it's their own, it's their own payload, so they can, uh, they can afford, you know, they shouldn't have anything go wrong. And I'm sure they're confident that nothing will go wrong. So, uh, anyway, I just wanted to say hello, give you guys an update. Take a look at that uh, fairing. I hope you can see the fairing. I don't know whether you can or not. I'll try to adjust this. Starlink. Starlink. There's 60 satellites up in that. 60 satellites in that uh, fairing. You have to bear with me here. I'm using a a phone. So, <laughs> uh, anyways, uh, yeah. I'm trying to read your comments, but uh, I have some uh, I have a tripod holder kind of blocking my view of your comments. Um, yeah, so the sun's setting here in Florida. It rained really hard today. I mean, it poured today. We had 45 mile an hour winds. Hello, Brazil. Hi there, Brazil. Good to see you. That's neat. So you're about the same time zone that we are. That's cool. Are you going to stay live for the static fire? No, I can't. Don't think so. I think the static fire will be tonight in the dark. So, I can't. I don't know that I'll be able to stay live for the static fire. But we'll have it. Uh, we'll have it tomorrow on YouTube. We'll have the static fire tomorrow on YouTube. If we're able to see it. Where am I at? I'm on Highway 528. 528. Uh, static fire with payload, yes, that's cool. I know, they have the payload up there. They have 60, uh, they, I, go, I guess they call them flat sats. So, yeah, I'm not sure. I, this could be 4.6, 4.7, 4, 4.8, 4, you know, uh, 4.9. This could be a lot of mini boosters. So, um, I don't know if anybody knows that yet. Uh, I'd like to find out. You know, I'll bet they're not using a new booster, though. I'm sure they're not using a new booster. Anyway, uh, where are you, where you from there? San Andre SP. I don't know where SP is. Uh, yeah, so we had a uh, very hard rain. Can you guys even see the picture? Uh, can you even see the, the nose cone of the rocket? Um... Anyway, oh, hello, France. How you doing? Why did it take space to fold all those la landing legs? Well, that's the first time they've done all four landing legs. And uh, they had to check out uh, some new... I think they may have redesigned the inside of the landing legs. They may have made some changes to the inside of the landing legs. So it's going to take them a little while, but they're going to get really good at it. 
and uh, actually once they got going it went really fast so they did good on the landing legs all good hi from Oregon hello Oregon yeah I used to live in Oregon a long time ago no not a long time ago anyway love you love you Oregon <laughs> uh, so yeah we had a uh, big storm here today wind blowing sideways I'm surprised they left the booster up. Uh, we got some footage of them lifting the booster this morning at 10 o'clock. So we've been here since 10 o'clock this morning. And we're going to stay here. We're going to stay here till we see smoke and fire, hopefully tonight. But we just don't know what time or we would stay live for you. I mean, the only reason I went live now is so you could see... The payload fairing. Mobile, how you doing? How you doing? Uh, hi, Lou. hi from Canada, Ontario. All right, hello. Mobile, Ontario. Cool, okay, good. Thank you, you can see it. Yeah, I wasn't sure because it's, it's not a real good picture. Now, our YouTube video will be, uh, it'll be a lot clearer, you know. We'll be filming in 4K, so... Uh, on our YouTube video, you'll be able to see everything much more clearly. Anyways, uh, yeah, uh, I think this is an incredible uh, uh, venture for SpaceX to uh, put satellites all around the Earth, thousands of satellites, and connect to people who don't have a connection. It, uh, it's really cool, and I think it'll probably be Elon Musk's most profitable venture. I really do. I really think that uh, he'll make more money than he does with Tesla. Now that's just, I don't know anything. Hello England, how are you? Cool. All the way in England. Cool. Yeah, tell me where you're from. Can you talk for a sec about your telescopic cameras? Yeah. In fact, my partner Ed's coming for this launch and we're going to have a one 18 inch telescope we're going to have a 7 inch telescope and also a uh, 1500 millimeter uh, uh, lens that uh, they use for sporting events that will all be mounted on his uh, mobile tracker unit and then that tracker gets connected to this uh, control room that I'm in so Unfortunately, it's a night launch, so you'll just mostly see flame, but it should be a good video, so make sure and tune in. Hello, Miami. You're close. Uh, 20 miles from Tesla factory. Yeah. Yeah, I wonder where the Starlink factory, where do they make the Starlink satellites at? Do they make those in Hawthorne? Hello, San Jose. All right. Birmingham, England. It's hard for me to read these, but I can, yeah. What time is the launch? 10.30, Wednesday night, 10.30 Eastern. Hello from New Zealand. Wow. That's all the way around the world. That's a great, that's great. I'd love to go to New Zealand. Uh, what time? What lift off? 10.30, but not tonight. Tonight's just a static fire test. Hello, Germany, Frankfurt. Hello there. Hello. Yeah, so tonight, um, I'm out here waiting for a static fire test, and nobody knows what time. They don't uh, give out the time. Hello, Frankfurt. That's cool. That's cool. Hello, Europe. Um, so, but that sure is a pretty, pretty rocket there. If you'd have to look really hard, but you can see the American flag on the side of it facing us. It's just tiny though, it's kind of fuzzy. Because you're looking through a seven inch Celestron telescope. That's where this picture's coming from. And uh, we have a Blackmagic Micro Studio camera hooked to it. From Wiki, SpaceX satellite development. So the, oh, Redmond, Washington. Oh, that's interesting. Thank you. Redmond, Washington. Yeah. Thank you for looking that up for me. Um, yeah, I mean, I think that's going to be an amazing business for SpaceX. 
I think that's gonna be they're gonna be able to afford a lot to do a lot more experimentation with the Starlink system up and uh, people paying for subscriptions like from all over the world so uh, it's really cool anyway uh, I don't know how much longer I'll keep this live I just wanted to do a quick hello to everybody and uh, let you know we're out here and uh, give you a shot at least a little bit of a shot of the uh, Starlink uh, fairing and the Starlink rocket be launching this coming up Wednesday at 1030 so hey thanks a lot you guys have a good night and look for our YouTube video yeah Melbourne Florida yeah yeah okay um, but anyway uh, look for our YouTube video of the static fire We'll probably have that out tomorrow. So, hey, thanks for the compliments. Really, it's 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 not that beautiful, but it's pretty. It's a beautiful sight to see a Falcon 9 on the launch pad with the sun going down and hitting the fairing, hitting the payload. And uh, oh, thank you for uh, checking our channel. Thank you all for subscribing. If you're a subscriber, I really appreciate. It. We really appreciate it. We work hard to try to bring you pictures that uh, you won't find elsewhere. So, anyway, I'm going to sign off. And thanks, everybody, for checking in from around the world. And check tomorrow morning for the Static Fire video. We'll see you guys later. Have a good night.